I'll admit, I kind of dreaded logging back in to upload this, but I've been working on rectifying the assery I've demonstrated up to this point, and part of that was talking to Laka Maka Laka again yesterday. I'll play what was said to me after I finished saying what I want to say, but Laka told me that the FCK victims felt hurt by what I've had to say and what I've done up to this point, and their request of me is to step away at the very least for a long time, and go and get therapy. And so I figured I would allow this to be explained because I don't know when, or even if, I'm coming back, and it's not really fair to those who will want to know why. But I've done too much damage already, and I'm sorry. Uh, again, I'll let the call do the rest of the explaining for me, but I would like to disclaim first that I was rather shaken up prior to that point. As you'll hear, uh, I won't deny I've been melting down a lot about the situation since it started, and as any of my friends could tell you, I've been rather stressed about everything since it started with Mad Lips. So, you'll hear me break at a few points in the call. Um, this is just kind of a warning to those who might feel uncomfortable about it. You have been warned. Anyway, here's the Laka call, and this is goodbye. Hey. Hello, Miss Doodles. Um, we're here to discuss the consensus of what the victims want from this. Um, is that acceptable? Oh, that's perfectly acceptable. That was actually going to be something I was going to ask. Yeah, that's why this call took a little bit. I was getting the consensus from some of the victims that... Um, what they want going forward from this because you know, I'm trying to get an understanding what they all want out of this and so mm -hmm. I got the consensus um, one of the consensus is um, therapy is um, what they want um, happen because they do think that you could uh, like they don't this is not for a derogatory way this is just it's for your own benefit. They do agree therapy is probably the best option here. Um, another thing is I, I've asked all um, a, quite a bit of their thoughts on this. Um, the main consensus is you probably should leave your platform for a hiatus for a time being while you go to therapy and work on yourself. Um, that is the main consensus is a, a, like a hiatus um, at bare minimum to go work upon the therapy and any issues. Um, that is the main consensus. There are some victims that do um, want you to leave, but the main general ones from some the others is a hiatus. Um, that is what I've gathered from asking all of them their thoughts on the matter, and I do think the agreeable approach would just be a hiatus and you get therapy to work upon any issues. It, that way um, you can come back at a later point um, in a better mental state, knowing um, better and any issues you may have you may have not been aware of, um, you have been sufficiently um, sorted through, you've got the proper treatment for, and all of that. That's the main consensus that they are more so in agreement on. There are some that are more like because of some of the things they they do they don't want you coming back to your platform. But with the general, yeah, some of them right. are in agreement for the long hiatus. But we are all in agreement that um, therapy is probably the best option to help you. Um, improve from any issues because we don't want you harmed in any way we don't wish ill will upon you where we want to make that very clear but the general consensus is you should get therapy and go uh, um, take a hiatus for some time and hiatus doesn't mean a couple months it it means a a while a while until these issues are sorted out I'm just trying to make that clear but I'm just being upfront with you what I've um, talked to a lot of them about because they are upset. Um, they've been looking into this outside of myself and they've, they do, they do feel some things about the situation. 
there are some that are very angry. And I'm just here to express some of their concerns, some of their pain. And the consensus, though, is the long hiatus with the therapy. Since you asked, like, what, what did the victims want out of this? That is the general consensus. Mm -hmm. um, there are some that do want you to stay off your platform. But yeah. they are not the majority. And I'm just letting that known. But um, did you need to ask me anything? In the meantime, and just because I, I, since this is probably going to be the last conversation we'll probably um, have, because um, if if you are going to go with those terms, I do know that you're not going to be online for a little while. So I, is there anything you need to say? Uh, I'm sorry. Okay. I'm just um, I. I. I had like a whole thing written out to kind of help me get through this, but now that all those are fair, I was actually planning on leaving my platform anyway at this point because I don't think I can handle it. But... If you feel that is the best for your mental well-being, um, we, um, I understand your endeavor and I'll support you if that's the case because I don't want anyone harmed in all of this. I want everyone to be okay. But if if you if that could help interfere with your um, therapy and your recovery to improve um, any issues, then I I will understand that decision. I'm just here to communicate what's going on, no, I and know. I do apologize. Yeah, I'm I'm not here to hurt you. I'm just here to relay the the issues. And um, sorry for the. Is there anything else? You know, I just I was just going to say I'm because I feel like you also deserve an apology. I'm, uh, I, I'm sorry for what I had said in that initial call. I'm sorry that I kind of just played it off as if nothing happened. Uh, I'm sorry that I was dishonest and that, you know, uh, if, if you felt like I had lied to you, then I'm sorry that I lied to you. Um, I, I'm sorry. I want to apologize to those victims. I, I, I didn't... Take a moment to breathe. Take a moment to breathe. All right. It, like, I don't want... You don't... Just breathe. It's all right. Just breathe. Just sort out your thoughts a bit. So, because I... I am going to relay what's being said. And I, I do want you to be able to get out what you need to say. So just take a minute to breathe. Grab some water if you need to. It's it's all right. I um, I I don't have a gun to your head. It's all good. No, but I just I just hate. Just just breathe. I just hate how I've been fucking everything up left and right. I didn't mean to use any of the victims for like a shield or as a defense, and I. I, I thought, I thought trying to put the conversation back on like ZZ and Toasty would help, but I see that I, it didn't. It didn't. Yeah, well, that's because the server as a whole needed to be discussed, and there were a lot of people that were aware of this by the time they left during in it and that caused harm too because that was enabling the harm and they needed someone to say something and that's why a lot of them do feel hurt because upon finding out it <laughs> that's why i'm just now. relating yeah all right just just take a moment to breathe a little okay all right like but yeah, that's that's what they're trying to express because, like, yes, Miss Zizi and Toasty are vile people, and yes, we are going to talk about them. But a lot of people saw them being vile and even joined it and didn't do anything to stop it. People saw it and let it happen. And when people did try to talk about this, no one no one came to help them. They were silenced. They were harassed, and some of them chased offline and hurt very badly. 
And that that's why I'm here because that they have trauma from this and they're hurt really badly. Mm-hmm. That's why I'm here to say like, hey, like we're relaying the consensus for what they want to do for each of the people in the server. And this was the one towards you because they some are upset that by the time you left, you were aware of the culture that Toasty was doing in that server to kids. You and I you. Know, I didn't know it was two kids, though. Well, all I knew. That's... As, as I tried to clear up in my statement, I didn't know the age of, like, Mimi or, or Teddy. I, I did know the age of Slimmers. I do know that you had had been particularly frustrated by that, but when I was in there, I was told that Slimmers was not. But that's still a thing, because by the time you left, you told me that you became aware. And I, that's the problem. I know what I said is... in that call, but I, I panicked. Unfortunately, that can't be retracted. I know. That the damage is done. I know. And I don't intend to try to undo that damage. Like, well, I, I understand you're upset. And that's why I'm trying to keep uh, keep level with you. But the the fact that, that there has been a lot of harm to these kids, and you told me nothing was done because you didn't have any experience, oh. is hurting a lot of them. Because you had contact with people that could and that has hurt quite a bit of them because you you talk to ponder you talk to quite a few people who do and none of them were reached out to and when these victims were getting attacked because some of them did come out publicly saying they were groomed no one came to save them people in this community knew multiple people were told from what i heard from the victims like even the ones outside of the FCK, there are some people that were told about this. And no one helped them. And that's why, like, I'm here to express, like, that's why they're upset. Because they, they didn't make their silence, like, their suffering wasn't silent. It was loud. And everyone looked away or joined in the silencing. And, like, there's pain there. And... That's why I'm here, because I know a lot of them, if they were in here, wouldn't be able to handle that pain, and they would lash out, and I'm trying to keep this level so you can understand that hurt they feel. Because this did hurt them, Doodle. This hurt a lot of them. And I'm not here to be a villain to you. I'm here to tell you about that pain. And I'm here to tell you, like, because... You're not seeing the devastation that's being done. And that's why I'm here to relay, like, hey, they needed that help. I know you didn't know what to do. You could have reached out. You could have done, like, to ponder, maybe look up online something. There's, there's options that could have been done that weren't. And these kids got hurt more and more to the point that a lot of them need serious help now. This has affected their mental development doodles. They're, they're going to have some serious issues for the rest of their life because of some of the damage done. That's, that's why I'm so upset. Because I, I see the damage. That's why they can't come in the call. Because if they were to be put in this call, they, they're, they're going to be a mess. And that's at best case. And that's why I'm trying to relate to you, like, the harm that was done here. The fact that a lot of the community knew. Nothing was done. No one said anything. And the ones that knew of, like, the grooming extent, like, Junkie knew about the grooming. And nothing was done. That, that has devastated so many. And I'm just, I'm not here to, like, off with your heads. I'm here to be the messenger of what they feel because a lot of them can't express how they feel. 
and how they feel is utterly devastated. They are in shambles. And that's why I'm saying, like, there needs, there needs to be a, uh, like, if you feel it's appropriate to leave your platform, we understand. But we do feel like, like, there, some people need to go to therapy. They need to take away from the internet for a while so they can actually get the help they need. Because the, like, because whatever allowed you guys to allow this to occur for so long is a dangerous sign for the future and they don't want this repeating again and i am in full agreement of that because they are scared there are more kids like this and i'm also of that same fear and we we'd want to make sure that doesn't happen so like this is not us saying like you're the devil we're trying to make sure this doesn't happen again so everyone can be in a better position and be feel safe and we feel like this is the the safe and best option that can help everyone involved. Is that agreeable for you, Doodle? Yeah. All right. Is there anything else that needs to be stated? No. Okay. Well, um, I wish you well on your endeavors. And have a try to have a better day. All right.